This is a Toronto Community Housing dwelling right uh, in the Grand Ravine Drive and Jane Street area and over my shoulder you'll see 30 gunshots that went through this building last night where there's a family that lives inside. Now a lot of the windows were shot out and they've been boarded up but you can see the remnants of the bullets in the walls at this, uh, this home where people live. Next door there's also a bullet in the front door as well. I talked to neighbors here, they're too afraid to go on camera, obviously, because they call this a war zone. This is a battleground right here. And the woman that lives really close to here, within, she could probably hear me talking now, said that a bullet went through her window last year and into her living room and almost hit her and her family. Needless to say, she didn't want to talk about it. Toronto police are investigating this, but they're also investigating a shooting not too far away in another, part of the, in another part of North Toronto where a man was gunned down coming outside of a restaurant. Things are really out of control. We're at 415 shootings, 63 murders. Toronto has become a place that's not safe anymore for many people. And I know the politicians don't like to hear it, but the truth is the truth because Stan Hall, who's shooting this, and myself every day, have been out at so many shooting scenes we don't even remember them all. Had a scene with 30 bullets in a house. 30. I'm Joe Warmington, Toronto Sun.